right, I got the alpha boost, got the alpha wheels. Let's do this. All right, just a little ceiling shot here. Yes, first try. I've been following Squishy Muffin since his original Road to Grand Champ series. A year and a half later, and Squishy's killing it. Making that money, winning lands, it's so freaking exciting. But apart from all the flashiness, what is it that makes Squishy so damn good? Out of all the players, Squishy definitely has one of the best ground game. His ability to set up shots and then execute is incredible. This is mainly because he spent a good percentage of his hours playing ones. If you want to learn how to play like Squishy Muffins, start playing ones. It will bring out all of your weaknesses. You'll learn when and how to challenge, how to watch your opponent while watching the ball, how to predict what people are trying to do, how to play defense, I mean the list goes on and on. And ones is really where you learn how to control the ball on the ground. One of the reasons Squishy is so innovative is because he knows the physics and he knows his mechanics so well that he doesn't even have to think about what he's doing. This frees up his creativity. If you can get to where even high level shots are second nature, you can begin to attempt shots that would otherwise be unthinkable. The only way to gain this kind of car control is to put in the time. Every minute you spend moving your car around builds up that muscle memory. Squishy never stops pushing himself, he never stops learning. In general, the faster you play, the better off you are. Now, I'm not necessarily talking about how fast you move around the field. Speed in Rocket League is more about reaction time, committing fully to your shot, recognizing a potential shot and going for it immediately, hustling back on defense. One example of Squishy's speed is his ability to quickly turn and challenge the ball. Squishy was actually one of the first players to fully utilize drifting in his game. I remember when I first started watching his Road to Grand Champ series. I couldn't believe how quickly he could turn his car around. Squishy is always moving, always trying to predict what his opponents and his teammates are doing. If you ever find yourself in a rut, go watch players like Squishy and work on matching their tempo. Squishy is one of the best passers in the game. He's actually said multiple times that setting up pass plays is his favorite part of Rocket League. If your passing doesn't go beyond hitting it off the backboard or trying to roll it up the corners, work on being more conscious of where your teammates are. In your next few games, try to focus on passing as much as possible. And don't be afraid to look for passes either. There's honestly nothing more gratifying than launching a pass down the field and watching your teammates score. I'm not sure exactly how many hours Squishy has put into Rocket League. Some people have said that it's actually around 9,000. Regardless, he works harder than any other pro player. In one of his older videos, he talks about how he improved so quickly. I've put a link to the video if you want to go watch the whole thing. Basically, he just started saving all of his replays, whether he won or lost. And then he watched them back and tried to figure out every single mistake that he made. He then went and figured out how to improve in that area so that it would never happen again. If you want to learn more about how to train and improve, check out my second video on how to play Rocket League. Squishy is a great example of someone who knows how to learn and implement new skills. Alright guys, I hope you found this helpful. Let me know in the comments what pro you want me to cover next. Peace.